Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to troubleshoot recording audio on your Windows 11 computer. So if you're having an issue actually recording audio, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully troubleshoot that without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is right click on the Windows Start button. And you want to select where it says Settings, go ahead and left click on that. And you want to select on the left side where it says System. And then on the right, go down to Troubleshoot. Go ahead and select that. Select Other Troubleshooters. And then scroll down and select where it says Recording Audio and select Run. And then hopefully would have been able to resolve the problem. If you're still having an issue, you can go back to System. And then on the right side, select Sound. Go down to your input. Make sure your microphone is turned on here and it's plugged in. You should see if it's working down here as well by the volume indicator. And if you need to pair a new input device, like another microphone, go ahead and select Add Device. And then you just go ahead and install it through here. Just follow the prompts. So again, pretty straightforward process there, guys. And you can also go down to all sound devices. So if you click on that, you should be able to view all the input and output devices on your computer. So make sure it is being detected here. And you can actually go further into the input devices here too by clicking on it. And you can see the format, so what channel audio it's using. So that's something important here as well. And input volume, you want to make sure that is turned on as well. And you can also test your microphone by selecting the start test button. And if for some reason, under general audio, allow apps and Windows to use this device for audio, if it says don't allow, you want to switch it to allow now to make sure it is allowed. So one more thing, you can select the check for driver updates. This should launch the Windows Update Utility here. You can also go through Device Manager as well. So if you right-click on the Start button and select Device Manager, And you expanded the sound, video, and game controllers. Go ahead and double click on that. Right click on your audio device and select update driver. Select browse my computer for drivers. And then select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. If you have a manufacturer specific one, I'd recommend going with that. Otherwise, select the generic one and then select next. Select yes. Go ahead and close out of here and restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that was able to resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.